going today? This is Samuel 21 with you and uh, today we want to take a look at the Roku streaming stick. Now as you can see on the box it says tiny stick, big entertainment, perfect for flat screen televisions and a point anywhere remote. Nice! Also it includes 2000 plus biggest streaming channel lineup. Nice! Isn't it? And, and at the bottom Right here it gives us a, an example, we have Netflix, YouTube, Hulu Plus, HBO Go, PBS Kids, Amazon, Pandora, Watch ESPN, Showtime Anywhere, and the, the Google Play app. Now on this side you can see that it shows you how to set it up. First, you plug it. On your HDMI input on your television or PC, connect to the internet, and then you can start streaming. So any device that you have, such as a PC or television that has a HDMI input, you can use this on. Then on this side over here, it tells us what's included. Now it includes a Roku streaming stick, a point anywhere remote, two AAA batteries. Uh, let me see USB cable power adapter dual band wireless and then what you're going to require broadband internet wireless router and a TV with an HDMI port although I would test this if you have a, a PC or a laptop with an HDMI input to see if it works now right here okay now this the top and bottom don't matter but as you can see right here in the back it shows you everything let's let me read it for you the best streaming stick and an outstanding value august 2004 from cnet slick design stony hd compact stick design and a vibrant video streaming up to 1080p hd awesome then search and discover, search across top channels, get updates or on entertainment that interests you. Sweet. And for those of you or us that love our mobile devices, you can send video, music, photos and more to your TV from your iOS, Android or Windows device. Now, if you don't believe me, you can just pause the video here and read it for yourself. And now, Let's open this thing. Now, right here, you see, as you can see, it has tape. I cut it. Same down here. I cut it so I, so I would be ready for the unboxing. So, there we go. And let's see, the first thing we have in here is, hi, let's get you started, Roku Streaming Stick. Instructions and Get a movie rental on us, visit, visit play.google.com, redeem and enter the code below to start watching today. Okay. I might just use it. Oh, and here we go. The start. Ooh. The start of the video. The Rocco stick itself. Poor Paul. And we have an HDMI. We have a, a USB. It has a USB right here. I think it's to charge this thing. I hope you don't have to charge it. Then let's see. USB. HDMI input. And then let's see. What else is included? Oh yeah, baby. The Roku remote controller. Now we have the home. The back button. You have the the arrows to navigate, your D-pad, you know, to navigate while you're watching TV. You have your play, pause. Your fast forward and rewind buttons. I think this is a replay and these are settings. And we have a Netflix button to go straight to the Netflix app. The Amazon one. Let's see what's this. Oh, your radio and your Google Play button. Pretty cool, huh? Nice, let's see. Yep. 
the battery should be in the box itself. Let's see. Oh, they're over here. Two, um, I believe, yeah, AAA batteries. And then we have a USB charger for it. Bam. The whole damn thing. Real cool. Now, let's see here. Oh, it even has, I didn't even realize that, but it has a reset button right there. Pretty cool. So if you're looking for um, entertainment in your television, now this is a good way to get it. Now the Roku stick is not actually that expensive. I mean, I think I've seen it for $49.99 on the store, but this one was included for free when I ordered internet, my new internet service, which I'll be using tomorrow. That internet service is called Sonic. Watch this. This is going to be the modem that I'll be using tomorrow. Starting tomorrow because I'm done. I'm through with AT&T. So, if you live in Sacramento, California, San Francisco, California, or Santa Monica, you can get the service. Pretty cool. Kind of looks like an Xbox. <laughs> you see, you have everything in the back. I have this bad boy running tomorrow. And hopefully, some live streaming on the PS4. Now, I hope you guys like this unboxing and uh, I hope you buy, I hope you guys buy a Roku stick so you guys could stream your entertainment on television and um, you know what, I'm going to show you the setup itself so I'll see you in just a second, okay? Alright guys, what's up? Here we are at the Roku setup screen so one thing I did forget to mention when I unboxed it is that it has to be plugged to power in order to work which is kind of odd but anyways as you can see here we have four languages available Dutch, English, Spanish and French so select the, the language that best, that's best for you for, as for me I could do this on either English or Spanish but I'm going with English then it says get ready to stream you'll complete you'll complete guided setup in three simple steps connect to a network get the latest software and activate the Roku okay so continue and right now it's looking for wireless networks and this is mine, AT&T 536 this is the last day that I'll be using my AT&T one so let's do this and since this is the last day I'll be using it I don't mind showing you the the code so So there we go. Connect. <laughs> and let's see if it finds it. All right, there we go. There we go. The first two steps are done. Now let's see. Alright, it's taking its sweet time. What the hell? Alright, you guys, so here we go. This is the Roku starting screen. And uh, I just completed the update for it. It had to update its software. It updated to the latest software. After that, it displayed a code that I had to, re that I had to input on my computer. I did that. It's, you have to do it at, in Roku.com slash um, register or redeem something like that 
and look at this we are now at the main menu and my controller does not want to work this is odd let me see in a second Okay, now it's working again, but basically what happened when I was uh, setting the Roku After I inputted the code I had to make an account online on my computer because I didn't have a Roku account and uh, Since I did once I did that I was finally able to choose which apps I wanted downloaded straight to my Roku And I selected Netflix Amazon Video, Hulu, and all these other apps that you see here. Now let's go here to Disney XD, see if we can watch something. Okay, it's telling us watch your favorite what your favorite. Disney XD shows, all you have to do is follow the easy steps below, sign in to your TV provider account, then visit watchdisneyxd.com, activate your com on your computer or mobile device. See, I received an activation code just like that when I did my my Roku activation thing. And trust me, I'm going to do this, that way my nieces and nephews can watch Disney. Now, another that I want to check out is the Roku Media Player. I want to know how this... Son of a gun works. So here we go. All right. So it shows us the media types: video, audio, photo, and help. So let's see. For example, audio. It says no compatible no compatible media servers can be found. Check your server network, server and network settings and try again. Okay. So basically, I have a network server on my PC, but I don't have it on right now. So I'll be able to stream my videos and movies and anything from, from my computer to the Roku. Same thing for my phone or on my tablet. All right, let's head back. Let's see here. Now Netflix. Now this I have. I'll be able to enjoy Netflix on Roku because I don't have a Netflix account. But trust me, I'm not gonna sign in. I know I can at least enjoy this. Now there is also Hulu. Now let's go to the other stuff. My feed. There is a welcome video I could, I could play. And the movie's coming soon, no thank you. Now there is the movie store where you can buy movies. And to do that, when you make your account on Roku.com, you have to enter either a credit card or your PayPal account, if you have a PayPal. I enter my PayPal, but I'm not gonna be purchasing anything just yet. Same thing with TV shows, you could buy them. Let's see. Oh, wait a minute. Here we go. This is one that I do want to watch. Let me see. Supergirl. And uh, do I have to actually pay? Yeah, one ninety nine for the first episode. Same thing for the second episode. Now, hopefully, this will come out on Netflix one day. Because I'm already paying for that service. But as you, but if you do want to purchase TV shows, if you want to purchase movies. See, there's a lot of categories right here that you can go through. 
plenty. Even TV channels. Like for example, let's see. Oh, there's Blind Spot right there. Law and Order, SVU, and many, many, many more. Let's see, CBS includes NCIS, NCIS Los Angeles, NCIS New Orleans, Scorpion, not bad. Then Fox also has uh, some hell of a good shows. There's ABC. Oh, and I haven't seen this one in so long. Then, are you serious? They only made 13 episodes? What? What the? Okay. Then we have our news feed. Let me see. Oops. Top stories. Let's see. Can we actually watch them? This yes. News comes from Washington, where Dow Jones is reporting that the Department of Justice will be finding Takata the air. Yeah, you can watch news. Then you can search for your stuff, a movie, TV, an actor, you know. Streaming channels. This is where you get your channels, actually. Watch this. Like, for example, these are some of the featured. Like, for example, Sunday, NFL Sunday ticket. Uh, Vicky, I have no idea what that is. Happy Kids 2, Radio.com. What else we have here? CNET. Watch, f f watch free flicks, free movies instantly. I doubt that this is free, but I will check that on my own later. <laughs> so you have a lot of channels and stuff you can watch here. Nice. <laughs> but this is only the feature list that you could search by other ways. Oh, we also have the Roku recommended and holy shit, break is there. Awesomeness TV is there. Damn. Let's see. Games, they have a fo they, they have some games you can download and play on your Roku, like Tetris Barrel to play, 2P, Retaliate, there is also Tetris, there's plenty of games here. Wait a minute, oh wait a minute, some of these you have to purchase, what? Okay, I get it. The hell's Birdie? Attempt to flap between pipes with this notoriously difficult and like oh Flappy Bird. This is another remake of Flappy Bird. Oh okay. But anyways, you guys. You can also go through genres. See movies and TV everywhere and TV. You could download any of these apps. Okay, now this one is coming my way, so I can watch my anime. <laughs> Crunchyroll, I'll download that later for you. Then TV Everywhere, let's go there. So you have AEV Original, but to watch any of this stuff, you have to actually have a TV provider, which I do. And look at it, you could go, you could just find it by, by genre, any genre you want, like, oh, this is one that I want, sports, like watch ESPN, is good, ah, NBA, which I already have, the WWE Network, I don't think so, NFL, MLB TV, NFL Sunday Ticket, and much more. Themes, I could download themes. Nice. I would download a theme later. Transform your Roku background to okay. Aren't there any free ones here that we could try on this video? Seriously? House of Cards is free. We have a golf. You see. Theme. 
Okay, let me just keep browsing. See if any of this stuff is free. Okay. Only that has of cards on is free, but I will do that later. Travel. See, there's your apps for traveling. And we also have a web video. Now, from here, I will be downloading Daily Motion, YouTube, Twitch. Let's see what else they have here. Okay. Okay, live stream is the premier place to watch live streams events on Yoroku. I might do that. Oh, hell no. They have AOL still here? What? Oh, the League of Legends Championship Series back below. We have, oh, IGN, I might get that. Oh, MLG TV. Look at all this stuff. GameSpot. Oh, watch Mojo. Now there's some stuff here that I will get. No doubt about it. But anyways, you guys, now you've seen the Roku, what it can do, and um, I cannot play anything from Netflix for you guys because I will have to sign in, cut the video, and also playing a movie or a, or a small clip will get me copyrighted. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys in the next one. So peace out, my friends.